Hey guys, or welcome to the top three Unity assets for December or January 2020, depending on you watching this. And I wanted to wish everybody, if you're watching it now, a happy new year for 2021. And I hope they have a great developing year to make absolutely fantastic games. So be sure to check out my great assets on the Unity Asset Store. Check my Patreon out if you want to support the channel. Join the community Discord, but we'll get straight into this today. Number one is the Hay Area Object Spawner, and this is a specific object spawner where you, it allows you to create complex or simple shapes on a terrain and allows you to spawn things into the hierarchy, spawn objects, trees, foliage, and other things with a very customized shape in a specific area or style. The next one is something called Spaceman and it's a unique 2D Spaceman sprite with a collection of two different animations. So it's PNG format with 15 PNG files at 512 by 512 with a walk and a flight with a jetpack. The next one is 2D Terrain Deformation and this is an asset which allows you to deform the terrain with a simple script with built-in terrains with an Edge Collider 2D component to show you how it works and you can have different on collision events and you can use the asset to do different impacts with weight and depth of when you drop that object on the actual 2D terrain itself. The next one is the Human Characters Free Sample Pack, which is a pack of 3D characters fully rigged and ready to go with 24 fully rigged models with six female, six male, and two variations in outfit with two idle animations compatible with Mixamo animation libraries, FBX, and it uses shaders compatible with all render pipelines. The next one is something called Simple Toon, and it's a, an asset which allows you to create a nice looking sort of toon shader, which has got flexibility within the color settings, advanced lighting controls, outline and transparency. You can use post effects and much more suitable for mobile and across the board with a free teddy bear model. The next one is the Battle Royale Duo Polyart and it's two different characters, a basic male and female with an assault rifle and pistol with a bunch of animations for shooting, reloading, getting hit, dying, being knocked out, idles, jumps, runs, rolls, dashes, power ups, victories and more. The next one is something called Scene Keeper and Scene Keeper allows you to keep your hierarchy intact that sometimes when you open up things within the hierarchy and then you jump between play mode and then out of there it might mess that up a little bit so this allows you to keep the hierarchy exactly how you left it so if you're debugging testing things and changing it within game mode and you go back to unplaying that game to the scene the next one is the level designer URP which is the grid tile texturing tools which is a bunch of level design props with basic tools for the universal render pipeline with 10 basic shapes both with flexible and static grid formats three types with dots lines and crosses seven example materials and allows you to easily level design specific areas the next one is there's two specific anime characters available for free for this month but this one's the anime character Maya which is suitable for a Japanese anime art style which comes with an FBX file using blender with a specific swimsuit and about 21,000 triangles and allows you to use animations from the mix and more webs. And the last but not least is something quite cool and it's called Selection History. And this is a utility for Unity which allows you to look at what you've previously selected, whether that be objects within your scene or things within project windows and assets. And if you've going through lots and lots of a really large project, you can configure and record the objects that you've selected so that you can see exactly what you've been using recently. So like I said, I wish everybody a great 2021. Be sure to check out all these fantastic assets and all the other assets that are featured across the past, the three or four years of however long I've been doing this. And be sure to check out my great assets on the Unity Store. Be sure to check a look at my Patreon if you want to support the channel and join me on Discord if you want to have a chat. So thanks again for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Cheers.